Hello everyone, hope you're all having a lovely day today. This is just a really quick message, I guess you could say, for people who maybe don't, maybe aren't as comfortable speaking or people who maybe feel like they don't have the opportunity to kind of like preach the gospel to everybody. Obviously, we're always saying on YouTube, you know, while we're still here, let's just try to keep preaching the gospel to as many people as we can. However, as you all have probably figured out by now, that opportunity doesn't always present itself every single day. When it does present itself, it's awesome, it's great, we should, you know, try to, like I said, get as many people saved as we can. But at the same time, it's not like we're going to be constantly preaching the gospel in every single conversation that we have. And one thing I was kind of thinking about a few, like I kind of think of this from time to time, it's that our lives just as a whole are a witness in and of themselves. I'm pretty sure I've mentioned this before in other videos, if I haven't, sorry. But the thing is that people might not always remember what it is that we say, but people will a lot of times remember how we made them feel, how we acted around them, our actions. So, you know, we're showing Christ to people just by showing people kindness. We're showing Christ to people just by showing them love. We're showing Christ to people when we're compassionate. And those are things that people will a lot of times remember. They might not always remember you telling them that Jesus died for all of our sins and because of that we're going to heaven. Obviously, we want them to remember that. But we're still witnessing to people just simply through our actions. You know, I'll sometimes have instances where I'll be like, oh, you know, I didn't... I feel like I didn't talk about God enough to this person, or I feel like I didn't, you know, give them the gospel and stuff like that. But some people might remember how kind you were to them, how caring you were to them. And that a lot of times means the most to people and will stick with them. I know it does for me. For me, like there are plenty of times where I just really needed someone to be kind and compassionate. And that's common, I think, for a lot of people. And so I guess the reason why I'm making this is so that you kind of don't feel like you have to beat yourself up over, like I said, not witnessing hard enough or not inserting the gospel into every single conversation. Because like I said, we're witnessing to people just simply through our lives. So I really hope this video helps whoever needed to hear this. I hope you guys are all doing well. I'm so sorry, I have been quite spotty for the past week and a half. It's just been, there's been like a lot going on. My semester actually just ended like a week and a half ago or two weeks ago, I guess. The last, not this past Saturday, but the Saturday before that, I was like done officially with this semester, which you would think would mean like, oh, now I can relax. Not really, because last week work was like, a lot. So yeah, it's been busy, you know, it's it's that time of year, you know, with the holidays coming up, everything just, the atmosphere just kind of gets busier. And so that definitely has been kind of like taking a toll and probably on you guys as well, I would imagine. But anyway, yep, I hope you guys are all doing well. If you guys ever have any comments, questions, or concerns, do not ever hesitate to leave me a comment down below or shoot me an email at my email address. Also, I have an Instagram where I give updates about this channel and sometimes I'll make little fun pretty Bible verses. Um, if you want to follow that, that'll be down here as well. And as always, have a lovely rest of your day and God bless.